Oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleaming, whose broad stripes and bright stars. and that is to rally the people. And that means taking an active role every day in the historic national debate that's raging around us. Do what you're doing right now. Stand up at every public meeting that you can get to and speak out. Attend the congressional town halls. I've got one at uh, Granite Bay High School, as a matter of fact, next Tuesday at 6.30. I need you there. Call in to talk shows. Write letters to the editor. Leave comments after every article that you read online. Email your friends. Link to information. Post on blogs and on Facebook and on Twitter. Support candidates and causes. Agitate and agitate and agitate in every forum that you can find. People say, well, what difference is that going to make? Obama and Pelosi and Reid won't listen. And that's true. But the voters are listening.
in Las Vegas, why we're here, to look above that building and see what's flying over that building, the American flag. It represents freedom, life, liberty, justice for all, governed by the people, for the people. That's why we're here, because this isn't their building, this is our building. It's your building, your building, your building. In a land where freedom reigns, in a land of purple majesty above the fruited plains, you should tell them of the soldiers who had courage and were brave, who fought in wars and battles to ensure old glory waves. They stood with pride and honor and fought with dignity to protect the ones who couldn't fight and a land that we call free. We should honor fallen heroes by flying our flags high. Salute the men and women who have fought and who have died. For some they fall, they pay the price. For freedom's here, they sacrifice. They gave their lives for you and me. I'm a man.